Hello viewers, this is a tutorial on how to automate auto reply to new message on LinkedIn using Sozinator. When you receive messages on LinkedIn, Sozinator can help you out in replying to them. Let's start with the accounts manager screen from where we can navigate to configure the accounts. To do that, right click on your LinkedIn account and hit go to tools. It will take you to the account configuration screen. You can also see the available activities which can be automated on LinkedIn through Sozinator. Let's click Auto Reply to New Message. This is very useful as it makes it faster and easier to reply to a number of messages within a period of time while narrowing them down in the process. There are several configuration categories for Auto Reply to New Message activity. Let's start with the first one, Message Filter. This allows you to filter the messages you want to reply to. The first option will allow you to reply to all messages, while the second one will allow you to reply only to messages that contain specific words. Separate the words using comma. So for example, hi, comma, hello. So when the messages contain any of these words, then Sociator will auto-reply to them. You may clear using the clear all button, and it's gone. You may also import from CSV or text file by clicking this button. Select the right file, LinkedIn sample message for example, and click open. And it will be uploaded successfully. When you're done, click the save button. The next one is input messages. Here, we can create and manage the messages we want to send. If you hover on spin tax, you can see the format. So you can add several messages, each separated by that symbol. So let's say hi, separate with the symbol, hello, separate with the symbol, hey, for example. Again, you may clear or import using these buttons. And if you check spin text, then Sozinator will randomly select any of these messages as your reply. You may also click the photo button over here to attach a picture to your message. Select the right file, or in this case, the right picture, and click open. And it will be uploaded successfully. If you hover on tag, you can see the format in tagging LinkedIn users. So if you want to tag LinkedIn accounts, then follow this format. For queries, it depends on the configurations we set earlier. So we have the option to reply to all messages or only to messages containing hi or hello. So let's select all. Then when you're ready, click the add message to list button. It will be added to our messages list over here, so you can see the messages, the query, and the action button over here will allow us to edit or delete the message. The next configuration category is job configuration. This allows us to choose the speed at which an account should reply to messages. We have already created a few activity speed configurations which you can use, like slow with an average daily activities of 66, medium with 125, fast with 208 or super fast with 333. Super fast is not recommended for new or real accounts. If you want to define your own speed settings, click advanced settings. Delay between each operation is the number of seconds between each message is replied to. Delay between jobs is the number of minutes the software should pause after replying to the number of messages you set in number of messages per job. Number of messages per job will allow you to specify the number of LinkedIn messages you want to reply to per job or per cycle. You may also specify the number of LinkedIn messages to reply to per hour, per day, and per week. Click this box to increase each day with a specific number until it reaches another custom number of max connections to message per day. You can also create a daily schedule under day of the week when to operate. This is very useful if you want to keep replying to messages even when you're asleep or busy doing other things. If you don't want to operate on let's say Monday, click the trash bin button under Monday and it's gone. You can add multiple time frames in one day. Simply click the day you want to configure, Monday for example, provide the start and end time, let's say 12 a.m. to 1.59 a.m. and click add interval and it's added. Let's add another one on the same day. Let's say 2 a.m. to 11.59 p.m. Click Add Interval. So as you can see, we can have several schedules in one day. You may save these time settings by clicking Create Favorite. Let's call it LinkedIn Reply. 
reply, for example, and click save. We can then open it by clicking select favorite time and choosing LinkedIn reply. The next tool is user filters. This allows us to filter the users we want to reply to on LinkedIn. For example, check this box if you want to reply to LinkedIn users who have profile pictures. The second one will allow you to target LinkedIn users with at least 500 connections. Check the third one if you want to target users who have enabled advanced bio and skills. Then the fourth one will allow you to specify the minimum characters in the bio of the users you want to target. For must contain specific words, click it to specify the words that should be in the user's bio description. Let's say expert for example. Again, you may clear or import using these buttons and save when you're done. The next one is the opposite of the previous one. So these are the words that should not be in the bio description. So let's say fresh graduate for example. Again, you may clear or import using these buttons and then click save when you're done. The next one will allow you to specify the minimum number of skills for each user. Let's say at least five skills. Then check the following if you want them to have experience details and education details. The last tool is manage blacklisted users. Blacklisted users are the LinkedIn accounts you do not want Socinator to interact with. So check this box if you don't want Socinator to reply to these users. This can either be a private blacklist, which belongs to a specific LinkedIn account, or a group blacklist, which is shared between all the accounts you add. When you're satisfied with all the configurations and are ready to start replying to new messages on LinkedIn, let's scroll up and click Save. Success. Then click the status button to make it active. Now that it's active, let me show you another option in automating auto reply to new message on LinkedIn through Socinator. This one allows us to create campaigns, which is perfect for multiple accounts. To start, let's go to the upper right corner of the app and click the social drop down button and select LinkedIn. This will take us to the accounts tab. Let's switch to the messenger tab and select auto reply to new message on the left side of the app. Here we can name our campaign. Let's call it LinkedIn auto reply to new message. For message filter, let's reply to all messages. For message text, let's type hi for example. For queries, reply to all messages and click add message to list. And it's added to our messages list. For job configuration, let's select slow. For user filters, must have profile pictures, must have 500 plus connections and experience details, education details. Finally, let's skip blacklisted users, private blacklist. When you're ready, let's click the blue button, select account or accounts. In this part, you can select multiple LinkedIn accounts. Since you only have one account right now, let's go with that by checking the box and click save. After saving, let's click the red button, create campaign. If you want to proceed, click your account and the save button. It will automatically bring us to the campaigns tab where you can see that we have successfully created our LinkedIn auto reply to new message campaign. Click the status button to pause the campaign and the action button over here will allow us to edit, duplicate, or delete the campaign. And that's it for this tutorial. I hope you learned a lot and thank you so much for watching.